Hey there guys, um, I know that I haven't been active throughout the years, apart from, you know, two videos, one of them being the splash screen and the other one being the, uh, the vlog, but uh, I do have my reasons for uh, things on this channel being stagnant, and I'm about to, uh, I'm about to talk about them. I've uh, got three topics here that I'd like to discuss in this recap and then uh, we're going to move on from there. And also, I recorded this before and the footage got corrupted and now here we are. So the first topic I'd like to talk about is my inactivity on the channel. Um, as I've mentioned in the, uh, in the latest vlog, um, the reason I haven't been able to make any videos as of recently, aside from the fact that animation takes a long time to make, is because I've been doing some freelance and commission work, um, freelance commissioned animation work that is. Um, I mentioned in the previous vlog that I was working with the Courage the Cowardly Dog creator, John R. Dilworth, in uh, making his short, Howl If You Love Me. I'm happy to say that, um, as of July this year, uh, my work with Mr. Dilworth has long since finished, and the short is um, is complete. Uh, and as and as I'm recording this, uh, it hasn't been distributed or uploaded yet. But I'm really looking forward to it because I really enjoyed my work with him. And uh, I also have a commissioned animation that I've been working on throughout the year. I actually started on it uh, this year. And I, uh, I got 30% of it done, and I plan to do the rest of the 70% next year. And I'm uh, really, I'm really excited for it because um, it's my first commissioned job. And I also have a commissioned job after that one, uh, which sadly I haven't been able to start on because of other stuff. But I do plan on um, getting that done, and after that, I'm just holding off on commissions altogether. Not permanently, but, you know, just until I can get my shit together. Also, another thing that's taken up my time was uh, taking up uh, miniature building as of recently. Something I've always wanted to, I've always wanted to do and that I've, um, I've actually grown to have quite an affinity for. So, um, I'll put some pictures of my works here. And I think they're all right. They haven't fallen apart, so that's a good sign. Another reason, the main reason I haven't been active is because, well, I've been trying to produce content for the channel. Yes, the, uh, yes, the act of trying to produce content for the channel is why we haven't gotten content on the channel. As I've mentioned in the previous uh, recap, and as I've mentioned ad nauseum, is uh, that I wanted to uh, start branching into animation. I want to start making, I want to make this an animation channel. There was no way I was gonna abandon this channel right after giving it a fresh coat of paint with an entirely new name, an entirely new splash screen, an entirely new mascot. And, uh, but I do have uh, big plans for the channel, um, which I'll be getting into. Uh, but right now I want to get into the second topic, which is personal stuff. As of uh, April 13th, I've long since resigned from my previous job because I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Full disclosure, it was absolute garbage. The whole place was a fucking dumpster fire. Uh, I don't want to go into too much detail about it. I'm not comfortable with doing that. I might some other time, but not right now. But also... Uh, the double-edged sword kind of occurs when it comes to actually finding a new job. I've um, I've never been too uh, too gung ho about customer service, and sadly, it seems like the thing I'm I feel I'm most qualified for. Um, it's just uh, I've no, I've never been able to uh, talk well with people I don't know, and I don't work well under pressure at times, and. I know that's a problem with me, and I should have the commitment to try and um, overcome it. But uh, I'd probably make it a last resort. I probably want to work at the back where all the stock is, but I'm just rambling at this point. I have been thinking of working in animation for such a long time. Unfortunately, I just don't have um, much to show for what I what I currently do. 
that's kind of why I've been trying to get some animations out and why I've been taking commissioned work and whatnot. It's because I want to be able to build up my demo reel and try and um, really try and show uh, my skills. And uh, unfortunately, a lot of the things I have on my channel right now are either really outdated or really shit. It's you. It's mostly the latter. I want to try and make some new animations, some new content that really show how I've improved over time, um, according to according to other people. I want to. I don't just want to show like random bits and pieces. I want to show bits and pieces that really show off my strengths in um, in whatever medium or whatever software I'm using, and whatever techniques I use in uh, in terms of my drawing and that. Now we move on to the future of the channel, the third and final topic of the video. Um, as I've said, the channel's still going. I'm still trying to get things ro rolling. I've got a few projects in the works, the three upcoming skits, and also I've written all the scripts for uh, Make The Mon, which I'm really looking forward to ending. I've already gotten the three skits storyboarded, I've already refined their storyboards, I just need uh, the voices recorded and the animatics made and then we can well and truly begin production proper. And make them on, I'm gonna storyboard all that, get that into production as quick as I can, as best as I can. And I've also got an animated series that I'm trying to get off the ground, I've already got all the scripts uh, written and about, I'd say, 20 to 25 percent of the storyboard's done, with uh, help from other people. And uh, I'm just well and truly hoping I can make up for uh, lost time in that front, and yeah, double down on storyboards on my end. And I've also still got the, uh, you know, the commissioned works and the collaborations that I'm doing, and uh, I assure you, after that, I'm going to hold off on commissions until I can um, until I can really get a good work schedule flowing. Um, yes, I'm, I'm editing this right now as you can see. I just forgot to mention that uh, I also got something planned, uh, a little project in the works relating to the, uh, to the skit stack series. It's not a new live action skit, I'm done with those, but um, it's sort of a behind the scenes uh, look at uh, skit stack and you know, it's history and whatnot. It's a five-parter. I've already got all the scripts down, and I'm gonna be, be and I'm gonna begin filming uh, next year. So, if you're into behind-the-scenes stuff and you somehow like Skit Stack, you have that to look forward to. And uh, the miniature building uh, that is definitely gonna come to play in terms of uh, filmmaking. You know, combining my two passions. But mainly it's just, uh, at the moment, it's just a little hobby that I do that's both arduous and, um, and therapeutic and rewarding. Much like animation, now that I think about it. I apologise for the lack of content, it's just that um, I have a life. But also because I, um, I just want to prepare stuff and try and, and, and try and work on my future and try and better my future. And... Uh, so yeah, that's all I have to say. Um, I hope you guys are looking forward to the new year. Um, I can't say uh, either way. And uh, hopefully we can see some content flowing in during that year. So um, thanks for watching guys. Uh, as always, uh, have a good one.